Hello everyone on Twitch, this is KL Tech Nerd. I am back and I just did a quick uh, Google search and did an internet search and uh, I'm trying to see if I could uh, figure out what's going on and I'm still not quite sure what's going on. So we'll just... Uh, I know it sounds weird to say but uh, let's just um, ignore it and hope that like it's just a fluke. Like, maybe that after we get the doors more working and stuff like that, that it'll just kind of fix itself. Hopefully they didn't just, like, make baby villagers and then they popped out the opening or something. That would be bad. That would be very, very bad. As here, I'm getting mad because they're not making babies, and it turns out that they did make babies, but the babies came out of the uh, storage unit right there. Anyway, though, let's just let them be, and hope maybe they'll do something when we're not watching. I don't know. Whoa. Ouch. I need to be more careful. Shoot. Because according to everything that I've been reading, there is no change between the villager mechanics on the Xbox version. Now, it could be that later on it's going to get updated and everyone's going to go, oh no, they did change it. I don't know. But for right now, I'm just going to treat it like as if everything's normal. And it's just the same way that I already know about. Because... Ah... Uh, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Right? But it looks to me like they changed it because it looks like that dude is like ready and then the other one's like tired or wish I had an emerald so maybe I could trade or something or because that guy's getting hearts and he's like what the heck Oh, okay, yeah. The one that I didn't like. The one with the gravel and the emerald and... Ugh, yuck. I don't know. Maybe it'll fix itself. Come on. Anyway, let's just hope that it fixes itself. So let's finish this side up. And wow, I cannot believe that I'm out of dirt. I ran out of dirt. Get over here, dirt. Okay. So what I'm thinking is, let's just clear out all of this. So I have enough room to work. Now, from what I'm reading, the um, iron golems that I'm going to be getting in this are going to be... Um, three blocks high, so whatever chamber I decide to have them in, I need to make sure that they can't jump out, so I'm thinking three blocks in-ish? I don't know. I'll see how I do. I mean, I might go more just because I kind of would like for it to be in line with the um, system that I already have set up. Oh! Are they both having hearts now? They just didn't like being watched? They were shy? Okay. Oh, come on. 
Give me a break. It works, it works, it works, it works. Now, suddenly, now that I need for it to work, it doesn't. I know it's going to take some time, too, for them to uh, create enough villagers to... Because uh, I think it has to be like 21 doors. Dude, what's going on there? That is weird stuff. Enough, golly. I might have to make it wider. Uh, do I have any gravel? I already kind of know I don't have any emeralds. Actually, what I really should do is just this, and then... No, there's no door. Okay. So then we go over here. See, it looks like they're ready to... Do everything, but then there I don't see any kids. Actually, I wonder. Because I thought I saw hearts coming out of the mold, so it's like, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, whoa. Yay, I did see uh, a child. And it was a librarian, too. That's exciting. Yay. So, yay, that's how you get a kids in this game. So, yay, they made kids. It works, it works, it works. Yay for the villagers. And let's not die just yet. So I'm thinking there's one level. So we have one. Already the iron golem should not really be able to get out of here. So... Okay, I'm, get, I'm starting to lose daylight again, so... Grr. Finally got it new villager and everything in there. <laughs> I have to go to bed. Okay. I'm so excited, though. I was afraid that the mechanics had changed or something when they did the update. But alas, no. It's going to take a while, though, to be able to make more kids because I'm starting with just two of them. But at least it's doing it. At least it's working. That's the important part now. I need to go over here and make some signs too. Ah, uh, whatever. If it's too many signs, it's too many signs. The important part is, is that I learned something. I'm not sure what that thing is, but... <laughs> Let's go do this now.
and then let's go do this because I wanted to be able to kind of see inside of here. Now this is three deep. That's probably still a little bit too deep, but darn it. I kind of wanted to be able to Okay, now. Where, oh, where did it go? Okay. We have, okay, we have more of the pickaxes, so if it breaks, it's fine. Anyway, I'm so happy to see that the mechanics didn't change. I was seriously afraid that they did when the update happened this morning. <sighs> that tense moment when you're like, did it work? It's going to take a while, though, too, so I can work on this while I'm doing that. Now, I'm thinking about being semi-adventurous. I'm wondering if it's right, though, for me to have a gi gigantic tunnel like this. And again, the two, I guess it really doesn't matter, but... I kind of like the idea of the access panel being over here and everything. Anyway. So I'm thinking, let's go do this. Now, if that's the case, and then I decide to point it this way, the bottom of it, I'm thinking, should probably be right here. For the obvious reason, too, because then that way I have this nice little chamber down here that I can um, work in. because I wanted to leave like a maintenance area so I can see everything working and stuff. So if that's the case, then I probably should go and then do this. Now if that's the case, then this is going to be the bottom of it. And I'm going to have it. So, do do do. Actually, I might even make it even taller. Because I still need to have the hoppers, too. Ooh, how exciting! And the 
real bonus for everything, though, is going to be when I'm going to have um, five villagers or so. So I could just as easily um, like have two groups of kids show up. That those those first four are going to be the hardest to show up. I definitely don't want for iron golems to start falling on my head, though. So I'm thinking I'm going to leave it like this for a bit. And Oh, thank goodness I thought about that. Because I was going to have it to where, like, let's say, this would be where the bottom of the machine would be, but then I realized something. There's going to be hoppers that are going to be there, and there's going to be water tiles that are going to be there that are going to be uh, controlling the um, device. So, like, let's say the hoppers are right here, then I would want to have um, the machine here. And actually, now that I think about it, I wonder if I can get away with just not having any um, water. Yeah, I'll do the water anyway, because that's how I was always taught to do it. And if I do this, I'm trying to think of where the signs should go. Actually, I might need to fix that and raise it or whatever, or lower it or whatever. Because the, the signs is what the lava is going to be sitting on. So... When the lava is sitting on it... That means that this block is going to be the killing part. You know, that seems high enough. I don't really mind it. Yeah, I don't really mind it. It's fine. It seems fine. And then, when that's the case... Do -do -do -do, boo -boo -boo -boo. The lava sits right here. The iron golem's head is going to be right here. Its middle's going to be right here. And then its body's going to be right here. So now I'm going to want want for it to do this. So its middle is going to be right here. So then it's going to be sitting right here. And okay, I like that. I can dig it. Because... That means that the back of it's going to be right here. So, okay. So, like, let's say, okay. So this is essentially where its feet are going to be. Well, not where its feet are going to be, but if I, um, have a um, And I'm going to have to go run to go take a nap. Darn it. Oh well. And 
just for the sheer heck of it. Let's go do this. Because it's way too freaking dark. There we go. Okay. I like that. So now we can just go underneath the machine. So its feet are going to be right here. See, the idea would be for the hoppers to be... I must go get the hoppers. Because hoppers... And that amount of doors so far should be more than enough for the villagers to start uh, a little village. So here's the hoppers. And actually, that's not even going to need to be the hoppers now that I think of it. Because what's going to happen is we're going to go over this way. go do this. And actually, now that I think about it, since we're going to be doing this, I'm going to go put a viewing wall in the back of it. So hopefully no monsters get in and attack me. Because essentially what's going to happen is this is the back of it. The lava is going to sit up here. I'm thinking, what if instead I put a window like that? So that we could have a window looking in on the uh, iron golems. And then that way too, I can see what they're up to and everything, and we could watch them as they're uh, getting processed. That's just a fun way to say, they're dying. So, actually, I might... Uh, might leave that, too. I don't know. So let's go. Put 
this right here, then put this right here, and that works. I like that. And then... So what's going to happen... I'm trying to think if I'm making this a little too tall. But I don't think I am. Might be making it a little too short. Might have accidentally put those in a little too fast. What if I lower this like this? No, that's... Darn it, okay. There's not going to be any hoppers in here. That's the big difference. So I think that to do it, we have to have the signs right here. Because the lava then is going to be up here. See, I think that's the big problem. I, th I, I, I assumed that I was going to put hoppers directly in here, but um, I vaguely remember reading somewhere that that's a no-no. So let's go and then put that in there. Let's go put the water right there. And basically what's going to happen is that now we're going to put the water right there and then it goes one, two, three, and... I'm not going to put the last glass in because then I'll have to break it. But what will happen is that then the items will go, okay, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and this should be where the hoppers are going to be. Yes! If we really, really want to double check, all we would need to do is bust open this window, or this side. should happen is that we just put water there and it'll wash any items out. So I'm going to go get the bucket and uh, it looks pretty close actually to the um, wow that's a lot of ice. Okay. Okay, it's getting nighttime now. Let's go and take that nap. Take a nap.
da, 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 da. So then let's go over here. There we go. That was strange, but it worked. It worked very, very well, too. I'm going to go run over there right now before I, uh... Oh, there goes my pickaxe. Okay. Hopefully it'll be okay for a little bit. So this should be more than enough pickaxes to at least be able to finish this project. At least be able to finish the project. So if we go over here... do that. So, hey, look at that. Perfect. So now... Anything that goes in there should immediately become trapped. Hopefully that doesn't include me, though. And I probably should have put the hoppers in first, but... That'll work. And actually, I probably could get away with putting the hoppers right here. Dang it, what did I do that for? And then just doing this. And what will happen is the items fall in there, and then these items go into a treasure chest. So actually, just to get the iron, you can um, just go to a treasure chest that's right in here. It'll be good. I like that. I might dig out this underground space just a little bit more, though, too, so I can better um, deal with it. Uh, let's go check in on our villagers. Oh my goodness. There's three adults now in there. Beautiful. I like that. So this whole time I'm trying to work on the uh, killing mechanism for the uh, golems, the uh, adults are doing adult things. There's already another... Two more kids, too. Wow. I like this. You know, maybe we'll work right now on this side before we start playing with the lava. And I'm probably going to have to break 
um, that stuff so I can put in the lava, but, uh, whatever. Actually, I probably, I'll put in the lava first. Because essentially what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. So then when I go to go put the lava in, I don't actually touch the lava and get killed. But I do need to put a lot of lava in. So I probably am going to need to go get more buckets of lava. I don't know. I'll see how it goes. Hopefully I can get away with just one. This is the dangerous part, because after this, things can die just by getting washed into here. And now for the hopefully good part. And there we go. Okay. I, that might be a little bit too low. I honestly don't know, but it's in there. And actually, I saved myself three hoppers, so yay! That means that I should be able to um, get started a lot sooner on my future uh, endeavors. So let's go get started on this. Because this is where the cool part happens. Because now... Wow, really? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe not. Turning into one of the uh, villagers. As I'm just constantly opening and closing doors. Oh no, I don't want to go down that hole. <laughs> I'll get myself fried! Kentucky fried! And let me just do this so I can better emphasize the fact that this is no longer a play zone. I can no longer use that to get up and out of the uh, chamber. This is live. This is dangerous. And actually, I can probably do this. Oh, you know, there. And let's just go and um, make a bigger hallway too for this. Let's just do it alongside the iron golem thing too. Beautiful. So... And I love how that one place is um, actually starting to, uh, where I once had uh, f one, two villagers, there's now um, five? It's gonna, they're going to start packing in there pretty quick, I guess. So, better get started on this part. A little mad at myself, I guess, too, for not being better prepared on this part, but... Oh, whatever. Because now I need to fight against this, so... do 
not like fighting against this either, but. And I guess it's getting dark again now, too, so... Oh, yay. Ah. I can't believe how many, um... ...things I've been doing today. And this is exactly what we want. We want for it to stop right before it goes into the killing chamber. And then the iron golem has a nice little fall for himself. And then he gets cooked. Beautiful. So now we got beautiful, 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 um, water that's going out that way, and anything that goes in there is going to immediately be shoved to the, uh, center, which is what we want. Now, this part is for that. This part's for that. And somehow I got this thing to work before. Okay, cool. So that's what messed it up. I meant to do that. And then to do that... do that. It's because I'm getting freaking tired and it's been a long day. So now, let's go put that there, and then that there, that there, that there.
pas. And almost done. Perfect. Now, in theory, this should make it so if anything goes into the um, Anything goes, it should um, get swept directly into the center where it'll be um, thrown into the furnace, which is beautifully awesome because that's what we want. And I just messed up here. I'll figure it out. Oh, crap. It's going down the hole, isn't it? Dang it. It probably killed the, water, uh, the lava source. Hopefully it didn't... Uh, Let's go and build a platform out to here really, really fast. And oh no. Dang it. I'm going to have to go get a diamond pickaxe now so I can fix it. Really? How freaking... How am I stuck? Really? <laughs> There we go. Okay, so that wasn't pretty. See, I never meant for th these items to go right here. Matter of fact, I kind of do not know why they ended up there in the first place, but... Because I swear I don't remember putting them there. And I'm going to spend the rest of the time fixing this. Um, and then I'm going to go quickly and run and get the diamonds and get a diamond pickaxe so I can get rid of the abs stuff. Ugh. 
There we go. That's strange though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How is this thing eight, but yet it's... Oh, freaking... No! Come on, let me out, please. Okay, whatever. So if I go over here... Definitely figure out what's going on here first, though, before I start. So I think this thing might have accidentally put... No, it didn't. Okay. Then what is going on here? Hmm? Uh, let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Oh, that's... Irritating. <laughs> well, not, <laughs> but what else do I say, right? That's why it messed up. And it started going down the hole. I didn't want to do it though, but I'm probably going to have to go and get a diamond pickaxe so I can solve this problem in a reasonable amount of time because there's still the. Um, stuff from the lava in there. When I go to go um, get the pickaxe, I can also pick up more lava, so whatever. That problem's easy to solve, but irritating. So, now that it's finally daytime, let's go and fix this. Make sure I don't fall down the hole. And I fell down the hole anyway. Okay. Let's go and then do this. And I'll probably also go get a couple more stacks of stone since I do have that there too. Unfortunately, I have to go run home. Yeah, whatever. I can't believe I've done all this in one day. Whoa, I can't believe I just jumped over that. 
I can't believe I'm so accident prone right now. Then again, though, too, I have been doing this for over, uh, what happens when I play video games for nine hours in a row, right? Start making mistakes. Then again, though, too, this is a great Thursday's episode for anybody who likes this. I'm just going to leave that there because reasons. Bringing the s villagers all the way here though is going to be really difficult because I gotta go through all this first. Including wild dogs. Awesome. Ouch. Actually, what I really should do is just have like 50 different iron farms and just have them in a really, really long string just all going <laughs> uh, back to my base. Like all 64 blocks away. That'd be funny. This is my old base, so... Well, not my old base, but this is the mob farm, so... I'm getting close. Very, very close. my wheat farm that's still being worked on. withdraw. And I'm going to really, really quickly write something here, so I didn't leave, I'm st or I'm not sitting here doing nothing, I'm trying to remember how to spell. just know I just spelled this wrong, but I'll fix it later. There we go. And there's the chicken farm that I can put three of the hoppers back in. Not two, but three. Which is kind of cool. I'm going to take some of this while I'm at it. Might as well. I think it'll finish up the project nicely. Now what I can do, too, is do this. Oh, that's right. And then go down here, and I'm going to go get some lava. More lava. 
that hopefully this time I won't ruin. I think I'm going down the wrong chamber, but either way, there's going to be lava, so whatever. There we go. can go back now that I got the lava. Then I can go back up. And it's already getting nighttime. Oh. Yay. And. Uh, actually, right now I don't have it set up so uh, followers can. Um, that are watching the stream can join, but I am thinking about having an event of sorts. So, like, maybe later on in a. Uh, like in just one gigantic session I can have a bunch of people join but right now there's not really enough people to be able to say hey let's make an event out of it so probably sometime in the future I will have a bunch of uh, people be able to join into the game uh, if you want to you can follow to find out uh, more information and I also have a website and if I do decide to have an event where people can join me in the game I will uh, have it on my Facebook. I hope I answered your question. And I forgot what I was doing here. Uh, I need to get a diamond pickaxe so I can fix what I just broke. And really, really carefully, because I'm going to put these back to, to keep good care of them. And now I got my diamond pickaxe so I can fix the problem that I did in my uh, iron farm. And unfortunately, now I gotta run back. But, um. Did I answer your question, or uh, do you have any more questions, or...? And, you know, I'm gonna go over here really, really fast and... Don't want to fall down that hole.
let me see here. And I'll put this right here before I forget. Okay. So, just out of wondering, Hyper, uh, how long have you been playing uh, Minecraft? Get it? Okay, cool. And I'm going to get rid of you guys first, so... do that. Perfect. Why did I just do that? I don't know. I'm about to lose my mind. Thank goodness I had enough, uh, diamonds for a diamond pickaxe so I could fix my little blunder. And, oh, yeah, that's why I didn't. And, boosh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So now let's go down there and fix this. Come on. There we go. Okay, cool. So, let's do that. And then it should be Okay. Beautiful. So now I can get this stuff back out. I even got the obsidian, which is awesome. Okay. So, boom, da 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 da, da boom. There we go. Okay, so... Ooh, uh-oh. That is a problem.
and I sneezed the funniest way ever into the mic. Sorry about that, guys. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, that's why. Dang it. Okay, so there we go. Perfect. Beautiful. I love it. So now we have all of the items going down there. And, oh, I forgot. Go over here and Ugh. Da, 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 da. Oh crap. I just broke my own thing in the jig, didn't I? Do 
do, 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 do. Come on. And I'll do this and then Sure, I'll do that, and then... Actually, to be honest, I don't even need a chest. These guys will hold uh, most of what gets thrown in them, so... And I don't expect for this thing to be this huge, wonderful iron farm right off the get-go, so... Yeah, I think it'll be really, really good. I like it. So that's going to be the thing that's going to mince the, uh, Iron golems. Which is cool. It's cool. There we go. So now, let's go over here. And get some water. Water. So, in theory, what this thing should be doing So, let's go, and then... Okay, I do not know why it's doing that. But... It's not going in. Which is exactly what we wanted. We didn't want for it to uh, go down the hole. So... We are good on this end of things. So anything that goes in there is going to get throw. Oh no, not again. I'm beginning to see a pattern in this thing. The lava is destroyed. Again.
Dang it. Why does it keep doing that anyway? Oh, that was a stone pickaxe, that's why. Where's my diamond one? Well, I was taking better care of it than I thought I was, okay. getting really, really tired of the lava thing. Stone pickaxe right here. That should not send it over the side. Why does it keep doing that now? So, oh boy. Maybe that's why. I think I was being too whatever trying to rush. And I must have accidentally put the water on all the wrong tiles.
So... That shouldn't... Go over the edge. It shouldn't. There is no way that it should go over the edge. Now it's not going over the edge enough on the sides. That's at least different than what it was doing, right? cobblestone right here because I need a sacrifice to um, make it so I can work on the uh... yeah that has to be why it was messing up so much darn it I tried to rush too much and in the process of trying to rush I uh, messed up Take a look at our villagers right now to see how they're doing. They sound good. And wow, there is a lot more of them than there used to be. So I probably should expand this guy out too. So I'm going to make this too wide so the villagers don't get hurt. Because I've noticed that they're a lot less likely to hurt each other if there's, um... Don't tell me. Aw, oh, dang it. Picked up gravel by accident. Darn it. And you know what? I am so freaking tired of being out of cobblestone and everything. I'm just going to go use dirt. What are you doing? You're like jumping up and down at me, that's weird. Stop it! Oh now you I can use! Oh wow! Glass? For one emerald, nice! Let me just go do this.
So I'm kind of just trying to um, split up the villagers right now. That way it won't... Um, they can't... Um, that way if like a zombie gets in or something, they can... Um, I won't have to worry about them... Uh, all of them getting eaten by a zombie because theoretically one chamber should be safe. Dude, you're not going to get out enough. Yikes. Wow, actually, there is not as many villagers in here as I thought there would be. There's only like five. Then again, the two, I guess that means that the two adults, um, had kids and the kids grew up, so... Uh... So, yeah. There we go. Beautiful. Well, anyway, though, once this uh, thing gets going and once the villagers start um, multiplying faster and faster and faster, it should be pretty easy to get um, an iron golem to spawn. So I guess I'll create another video special talking about the iron golem farm once I find out why the villagers are so reluctant to um, do what they do. So hopefully it's not that um, I'm doing it wrong or anything, and hopefully it's uh, an easy fix. So, yeah. I'm probably going to be back on tomorrow, uh, and I'll hopefully have more information before then. But as the videos go, I'm pretty much wrapping this one up because I've been doing it for longer than I most most of the time that when I do the videos, and I'm starting to uh, make more mistakes. I think because I'm so much I'm not used to it. So Get out of here, cow. And okay, good. So there's more villagers now. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, what the heck? Why would I trade five diamonds? Those things are rare. The glass makes more sense. There's no way in heck I'm trading five, um... Diamonds for an emerald, that just seems like a bad trade. Hmm. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna let them do their thing for a little bit, cause... Farmer? Farmer! Blacksmith. Oh, the blacksmith is the one that... Dang it! Our first blacksmith, and he has the worst trade ever known to mankind. Would you guys should stop shaking your heads at me? It's creeping me out. I'm just going to do this. Where is the sun? Uh, I got time. Okay. Anyway, though, I may have time, but this video uh, doesn't. I'm going to wrap it up right now. Uh, thank you very, very much, everyone, for watching. Have a wonderful day. And hopefully my guys will get doing what they do best and uh, will make the iron golem farm work uh, at maximum efficiency. Anyway, have a wonderful day. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Bye. And I'll see you guys later.